Greg Docherty has caught Steven Gerrard's eye as Shrewsbury star helps force replay with Wolves. When Steven Gerrard sent Greg Docherty on loan to Shrewsbury Town he did so with instructions to stack up games and return to Rangers ready to challenge for the first team. Scoring a spectacular Fock Cup goal against Premier League opponents was not on the agenda but is certainly a good way to catch extra attention. Gerrard has his own association with this competition of course, the 2006 final against West Ham forever suffixed with his name, and will appreciate the levels Docherty reached as Shrewsbury came agonizingly close to upsetting Wolves. He was a master at it, wasn't he? said Docherty of his manager in Scotland. I've got a long way to go yet. The 22-year-old was utterly tenacious against Nuno Espirito Santo's side, covering ground to limit space and bursting forward when opportunities arose. Such as two minutes into the second half when Doc Curti saw Fejiri Akina Burhi carrying the ball towards the Wolves area and ran to provide support. He lashed his finish from a tight angle above John Ruddy into the roof of the net. I took one touch and away it went, he said. They've been on at me to shoot more. Doherty hopes Gerard was watching. He only moved to Ibrox from Hamilton last January, signing a contract to 2022, but the former Liverpool captain felt he would benefit from a spell on England. Coming here was all about progressing, Doherty explained. I had an honest chat and he said that to be a bit part player this season wouldn't have helped me develop. I can honestly say I'm learning every day and embracing it. I've matured a lot. I think he could see the benefits. Getting games in at this stage of my career is important. I'm closing in on 40 already. Goals are crucial and it's something I need to keep adding to my game. If people up north can take note, that would be great. Of course I want to go back and fight for my place. I'm determined to have a go at it up there. Doherty nearly scored in the first half unleashing a swerving drive that Ruddy only parried, and also delivered set pieces with consistency. Shrewsbury went two ahead when Luke Waterfall, captain in Lincoln's run to the 2017 FA Cup quarter-finals, powered in a corner by Oliver Norburn and Doherty admitted the League One side thought they would see it out. But Raul Jimenez struck back swiftly and Matt Doherty got a goal his performance deserved with a superheader from Matt Amitra or his cross in the 93rd minute. Oliver Norburn pauses to read a note, left, written by Shrewsbury boss Sam Ricketts as he prepares to take a corner. And the wise words inspire him to hit a perfect in swinging delivery, which is powered in by Luke Waterfall, above, to make it 2 0. The replay at least means Doherty's dad Colin can see his son play a Premier League side. He made the trip to Stoke in the last round but could not get to Game Meadow as the date was originally scheduled for a league game and he had prior engagements. When he's not here I seem to play well. Doherty said. He will probably start crying when he watches match of the day. He'll be at the replay, and my mum. They came to Stoke and drove straight back up to Scotland after that. My girlfriend and her folks are down as well. The support I've had has been incredible. 5 slash 5 Shrewsbury bridged a gap of 54 places with a punchy display. Late drama too. Sam Ricketts' team rose from 2-0 down to knock out Stoke at the Bet365 Stadium and Doherty says that performance gives him encouragement that they can go to Malinux and pull off a shock. Wolves scorer Doherty has other ideas, of course. We showed personality to come back, that's not easy in this kind of atmosphere, he said. It was very important we managed to scrape back. The manager would be pretty disappointed if we'd lost the game and you don't want that.